Welcome to Vegas, guys. We're gonna take a bike ride in a minute. We're at the world famous, world famous uh, welcome sign on the strip on the south end. So take a look. It's pretty busy today. What's up? What's up, guys? You gonna get your pictures? Woo! Gonna get your yes. pictures? Yeah, yeah. All right, all right. You traveling from where? Uh, Chihuahua, Chihuahua, Chihuahua. Chihuahua, all right. So are they, yeah. También. Eh? No, just kidding. Ah. <laughs> right here, Vegas. But well, uh, welcome, bienvenidos. Thank you. Compas. Compañeros de Chihuahua. They can relate. Who's here? Uh, Walt here. Welcome, Vegas to Cali. Whoop, whoop. Congratulations to the newlyweds here. <laughs> We're gonna take a bike ride down the strip in a minute, in about three to five minutes. We'll also take a look at some of the uh, private jets over here at the Reed International Airport. Got a long line for people to get photos and stuff here. Ronnie C, welcome. Ronnie C, welcome. Vegas to Cali. We see you, Steph. We'll go about a couple hours. It's a bright, sunny, sunny day. Gorgeous day to be out here. 78 degrees Fahrenheit, about 26 degrees Celsius. Uh, so it is warm and a beautiful day in Vegas. What a time to be here. My favorite time of year, springtime. She clicks bricks, welcome. Good to see you guys. Yeah, there's a little bit of a line to get your photo or video here. I gotta keep an eye on my bike over here. My bike's over here so it doesn't get stolen. Cause we're gonna, that's our horse for today. We're gonna ride that all the way down the strip today this is one of the free attractions here on the strip that you should check out if you're ever in Vegas it's actually a lot more spectacular at nighttime I actually know how to turn the lights on and off there's a breaker box right on the left of it right there you can see right there that will turn the lights on and off. I've done it before. Golf for me too, what's up? All right, you come in April 18th. Very nice to hear. Let's uh, get on our way down the strip. Let's get on our way. I'm gonna ride. We got Lucky Ducky here. He's ready to ride. He's got one propeller left. He's gonna save us and protect us from any uh, crashes today. Um, we're right next to a Reed International Airport, the main uh, airport here in Las Vegas. Okay, Vase to Cali, uh, you came by. Thanks for dropping in. Got newlyweds here. Let's uh, take a look at these uh, private jets over here. Let's take a ride. Coast is clear. Nope. Jimmy Ray Gosa, welcome. Lucky Ducky, yes, he's uh, gonna ride with us. He's our protector. Jay the Stud, what's up, Vegas? 
Jay Stug is here. It's gonna be a casual bike ride here. Beautiful sunny day. Spring day here in Vegas. Quite nice. Thanks for joining us. Let's take a ride right now. It's casual, guys. Just enjoy it. No pressure. Number one is safety. We're not gonna try to collide with anything. So we gotta cross the street right here. Uh, I didn't press the button, so let's press the cross walk button. Wait, wait. Hey, congratulations, guys. Welcome to the live stream. Congratulations, like your glasses. <laughs> it's party time now. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can cross. Yeah, let's go. We're starting on the south end of the strip. Let's take a look here at the jets. Private jets here. Reed International Airport. I would go into these jets right here, but they got Constantino wire right here. <laughs> Protecting people who wants to try to jump over. There's a jet taking off right now. See it? See it? E-E-K, -E I see you. It's gonna be a little bit di more difficult to uh, read the chat while I'm riding my bike, holding the camera, and also it's very sunny. And reading the screen is a challenge. I, I don't wanna put my phone on maximum brightness because that will kill the battery fast. So it's not super bright. My screen is not super bright, my phone screen. So it's harder to read the chat. So you guys, uh, I'm not gonna be talking as much as I usually do on my live streams. That could be good and bad. <laughs> some of you guys enjoy me yapping away, some don't. Some get serious migraines from, hear from hearing me. Whoa. Cool little uh, F-150 right here. Nice color. Passing the uh, Harley Davidson store here. This store is really big. You should check it out here. Check it out sometime. If you're ever uh, on the south end of the strip, hi guys. We'll get a little casual tour of the strip during the daytime here on a Wednesday afternoon. It's about 2.10 Pacific Daylight Time. See what we can see, so follow me. Here is... Um, the Dream Hotel that's going to be going up. It's under construction right now. You can see the large crane and construction equipment here. Looks like they're putting in the foundation here. Called the Dream Las Vegas. Work in progress. It's going to be something like a 20-something story hotel, resort, casino, from what I understand. This is the current status of it right now. It's the current status of it right now. 
Nobody's working right now. This is a great day to work. So why isn't anybody working? That is the question. Regina Pat, welcome. Whoop, whoop. Regina Pat from Canada. We love our neighbors and friends to the north. Canada. Canada. Speaking of Canada, I will be in Toronto in about a week and a half. I'm going to Niagara Falls, taking a road trip from Ohio across a couple states and staying in Toronto. I look forward to that. I've never been there before. Connor Lee. Whoop, whoop. Jessica is here from SAC. All right, Jessica. Trying to film everything and anything that's uh, happening right now here on Wednesday. Nobody's getting married right now at the Little Church of the West wedding chapel. Usually there's somebody here getting married. Maybe there's more divorces than marriages now. <laughs> Who knows? In the background you see net jets. JSX. Looks like another construction project here. We're going to pass by the Tropicana also, which uh, recently closed last week for good after 57, 67 years, 67 years of uh, business here on the Strip. Tony Sedano, welcome. This has recently closed too. You see the pink elephant there. The world famous pink elephant. The pink elephant has been abandoned. Hopefully somebody uh, adopts him. I hope somebody adopts the pink elephant. It's kind of sad. They've been, uh, they've been there for a long, long time, guys. And this uh, elephant used to make a noise. I looked it up. I forgot the, what it used to say. But it used to be really loud and used to sound off. Regina Pat, yeah, the Canadian uh, exchange to U.S. dollars is favorable for Americans. I see that. Thank you. Yeah, that's a pretty wide uh, exchange rate right there. Okay, uh, Tony Sedano, when did they close the Tropicana? Last week. JP, yet peace come in peace. LA Vegas, Mike is here. What's up, what's up? If you just joined us, we're going to take a bike ride on the strip. We have a uh, Mandalay Bay in the background here. There's a big convention. I believe it's a Google Google convention today because that's where I parked. That's why uh, they're doing traffic control here. good day for an ice cream cone it's a good day for an ice cream cone for sure maybe we'll head over to the link and get a Ghirardelli ice cream 
or our coffee over at the great, uh, not the great, the um, at the fashion show mall. His old Vegas visitor center. Nobody home there anymore. Okay, Tony Sedano will be out here tomorrow. What's the seafood out there? Seafood? I don't know, man. If you if you if you if there's food here, you will see it. That's all I know. If there's food here, you will see it. The Laughing Jackalope used to be here. Let's take a look at this abandoned building. Anybody sleeping back here? Nobody sleeping. This is prime real estate. It used to be the laughing jackalope. Not laughing anymore. One dollar Coronas back then, huh? One dollar Coronas. Desert Oasis. Motel and apartments. Desert Oasis Hotels. This is what the motels used to look like. I don't know. I don't know who lives here or it's actually a motel still, but the office is open. Okay. Okay, okay. <laughs> What's up? I got my sun protection on. I'm not about getting skin cancer today and I get dark spots on my face. If I uh, don't shield myself from the sun, so that's why I'm wearing mi sombrero este este momento. If you guys are wondering, Steve Ducharme, what's up? Welcome, good to see you, man. Superman, Bill Long, hello. The egg shop. No idea what this is. They sell eggs, fresh eggs, maybe. Some of the local small businesses here on the Las Vegas Strip, South End. Get your palm red. They'll actually paint your palm red if you need your, if you don't like the color of your palm, come get your palm red. Aquariums, animals, and me. You like my hat. All right, thank you. I'll show you what uh, all the stickers that I accumulated over the years on it later. J. Owen House. I think it's a magic show. Illusionist. No idea what it is. They just set up a tent here in this empty lot and use it. Put it to use. J. Owen Magic Show. And those two things right there, those two towers, supports, you see, they were, they were, they had a plan to uh, build a observation wheel, like the high roller that they have at the link. There's supposed to be a big Ferris wheel here, giant wheel. 
and uh, I guess they changed their mind. Okay. Trying to cross here, but no one wants to stop. No, oh, see? Oh, okay. You got one to stop. Thank you. Got somebody to stop for us. It's green for us anyway, so they're supposed to yield to pedestrians and for guys wearing sombreros on their mountain bikes. Here we're passing the, uh, the site of uh, that big tragedy that happened uh, a few years ago here at the, I think it was a 91 Harvest Festival country music concert. This was the site right here where uh, a gunman had, a gunman went into uh, the Mandalay Bay here, up here. And from one of these corner rooms, something like the 30th something floor, shot down toward this direction into the concert venue here, shot shot a lot of people. And I think over 50 people passed away from that. Rest in peace. It's now uh, still an open lot. That happened like three or four years ago, I believe. I don't know what they're doing. I actually have a friend that got shot in the Achilles heel. His name is uh, Eric Barella. I play pickleball with him. He made a full recovery and he did a documentary on his story. But he was here at the Country Western um, concert and he got shot in Achilles heel. He got lucky. I see uh, East Sider, over 50 and fantabulous, LA Vegas Mike. Uh, TNA Adventures is here, Amy S, Mrs. TNA, welcome guys. Whoop, whoop. If you're just joining us, we're taking a bike ride down the strip here. It's a beautiful sunny day, 80 degrees, 78 degrees Fahrenheit, about 25 degrees Fahrenheit, uh, Celsius. I'm going to try to go all the way down the strip. Uh, I'm planning on maybe a two hour to two and a half hour ride to see what we can see. So follow me, follow us. Welcome to the chat. Let us know where you're watching from. If you're having a good time, if you're enjoying seeing Vegas, hit the like button so more people will perhaps join us. Say hello to each other. Welcome each other. It's one big familia here. We're all about positivity and enjoying ourselves. It's all casual, guys. Uh, okay, aquariums are animals in me. I'm looking at you from New Zealand. Welcome. All the way from New Zealand. Love it, love it. Good day, good day. GK, Groose from Europe. Where in Europe? RK. RK, where from Europe? Here's uh, the price of gas. Gasoline, we go by the gallons here in uh, Nevada and Las Vegas. It has been going up steadily. Price of crude oil has been going up steadily recently too. So it's uh, 435 if you're paying cash and for credit cards it's 445, $4.45 US dollars. Teresa Moore, you do such a great job. Feel like I'm right there. Thanks. 
that's the idea. Thank you for your kind words, Teresa. That's the idea is to uh, put yourself in my shoes and see the city virtually. Top cheese, check out reggae in the desert. Yeah, that's coming up. Yep, yep. Similar prices over here. Where is here? Similar prices here. Where is here? Where are you watching, Top Cheese? What? 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 Uh, what am I supposed to do? It's saying what? What do you mean what? What what? Who? What? 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 All right, I gave up on this guy. I guess that means uh, I don't know what that means, guys. But uh, we'll we'll stop here for a second. Ron Peterson, gas here is uh, two dollars and fifty cents Canadian, though, right? Huh? Vancouver, two dollars and fifteen cents uh, Van um, Canadian dollars. All right, that's like. Uh, that's like uh, two dollars or dollar ninety-five in U.S. dollars, I guess. Uh, top cheese in Oregon, okay, nice. Our neighbors to the north. Broccoli wizard is here. He says wait. He or she says wait. The wizard. The wizard always knows what to do. Um, here is uh, Tropicana Resort Casino. It closed last week, guys. They will uh, demolish this entire property and they plan to build a, a baseball stadium here and an entertainment complex and possibly uh, a, a resort casino. Oh, it says, uh, the marquee says, Thank you, Vegas, for being a part of our 67-year history. Thank you, Vegas, for being a part of our 67-year history. Yes, indeed. What a legendary location and property. Um, uh, let's see, where can I go from here? I gotta get across. Everything's shut down. Fenced up. I'm probably not supposed to be in here, cause, but I don't know. We'll see. No, uh, it looks like people are walking around this area. There's a TV, television van, a mobile solar-powered television mobile studio, it looks like. That's their setting up over here. Vinnie P. Whoop, whoop. Yeah, Ron Peterson, sad to see you go. You got some memories here you want to share with us? My memory is, my memory is uh, going to the Salsa Congress here. They used to have the Salsa Congress, Salsa Dancing, every year here at the convention center. We used to go out here, have parties at the pool, and dance the night away. It was like a four day event, Salsa, Salsa Congress. Scotty C, they should, at least offer free graffiti time. <laughs> yeah, I think, uh, well, hopefully nobody draws on this place. We don't want to see that, man. We don't want to see graffiti all over this place. They got stickers already all over this place. See? Speaking of stickers, I got a lot of stickers I accumulated on my hat from conventions and uh, other YouTubers. So let's take a look at my hat real quick. We got straight out of Vegas, Joe, YouTuber, uh, talented uh, videographer and photographer. 
Hey, Michelle Roman Monroe, part of the VCC. I had uh, Mark the other me on here, but uh, his sticker fell off. It was a long time ago. Got Rocktober, Vegas Best Ideas, GLVTT for all the way from Denmark. Of course, shout out to Las Vegas Metro PD. That's right. We're going to get back on our way down the strip. Man, big pun. Big pun. Alright, let's follow the music. I usually usually stay on this uh, east east side of the strip because sometimes I lose a signal on the west side over by New York, New York. So you go ahead. You good. Uh, -huh. uh let me hit guys go past yeah good day to walk on the strip today Good day. Oh, you do? Okay. It's warm. Probably one of the warmest days we've had so far this year, 2024. Huh? Uh, this is YouTube. Yeah, the Laughing Lion. Yeah, you're on there right now. <laughs> Laughing Lion live. Gordon underscore Moriarty 22. Say it again. Gordon underscore Moriarty 22. IG. Gordon underscore Moriarty on IG. Whoop whoop. I got you though. Sam Sleepy Lion. Laughing. I do feel a little bit sleepy though. <laughs> That's Gordon over there. Passing M uh, MGM here. Gambling Granny is here. Whoop whoop. Good to see you, Gambling Granny. I hope you hit a soul changing jackpot this year in 2024. You and Dice. Good luck. Gambling Granny. Thank you, TNA Adventures, for putting up her link. Whoop whoop. Oh, yeah. Biggest. Some construction going on here, so what's new? Uh, oh, they're still working on the... Uh, last time I did live stream, uh, they were working on the lion here. Last time, last time they were uh, polishing the lion's balls. Last time they were polishing the lion's ball. Yeah, yes, sir, that's you. It. That's you. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, I didn't hear it again. Say it one more time. Gordon Moriarty, 22. Gordon Mr. Moriarty. Moriarty. Yeah, all right. What, what do you take pictures so, of? Yeah, I do street photography. So candy, street photography. Candy shots for sure. Out here or Anywhere. What? So I do a lot of traveling for it. So, oh, yeah, that's fun. IG, I got them everywhere. All that is man. fun. Yeah, I'm going to check it out. because yeah, I'll, I'll review it and then go to your and follow you there. All right, bet, bro. All right. Yeah, appreciate you, well, have a good time out here, all right? All right. I'll see you. See you around. All right, bro. He's a photographer out here. Uh, he said he travels to photo do photography. Uh, so yeah, I mean, look, uh, the the line's actually looking pretty shiny. 
more shinier. I don't know if it's because of the sun or they've been uh, polishing them. <laughs> I'm gonna do a slow ride. A slow ride. Now it could be pretty busy and I might have to walk on the strip here. We'll see. Oof. Whoop, whoop. So fly, so cool. Baby girl, gonna talk to you. You're so fly, so cool. Baby girl, can I talk to you? Middleman. Middleman marketing, okay. Whoop, whoop. Welcome. And they got the big buses here for the tourists. <laughs> Hello. Enjoy your ride on the big bus. We're getting ready to roll out, I guess. Let's go right in here. <laughs> Rock your body, yeah, everybody. There, everybody's getting a picture with the M and M. Picture with the M and M, the green M and M, the notorious green M and M. This this M and M store is like three or four stories high, three or four stories tall. I have to use my horn. Uh, like I said, guys, uh, if I miss you in the chat, if I don't see you and you make a comment, I apologize in advance, but it's hard to read the chat. I turned down the brightness on my cell phone just so I could preserve the battery more. If, if, if you leave it on adaptive brightness, it's gonna go full blast, full blast brightness. And that will drain your cell phone battery really fast, so. I put it down to half brightness and it's harder to see. I'm wearing sunglasses too. And it's bright sunlight out here. So if I miss you in the chat, sorry. But I'll try to read it as often as possible. Windy over here, windy. I don't want to lose my hat. Windy, windy. Walgreens, what is happening with Walgreens, man? I own stock in this company. It's the worst performing stock in my portfolio, Walgreens boots. Sheesh. Worst, perf they're like, they're down like 60% on the year while everything else is going up. <laughs> I'm going to hang in there for the dividend though. 
Oh man, but uh, Walgreens is stinking it up, buddy. What are you guys doing? What you doing? What are you guys doing? <laughs> I see you. We're gonna bypass this area. This is the boulevard that's being built right now. It's uh, it's hard to uh, when there's pedestrians in there. It's, it's a tight, it's a tight squeeze. Ah, oh. this is uh, hi. <laughs> look at the look at the progress I hear. This is the progress on the boulevard. They're working hard on it, looking to open it this uh, fall, I think. Looking to open it this fall or winter, I think. Whew. Tight squeeze over here. Uh, Arcane one, one one sevens here. Arcane, DG Productions here. Whoop whoop. Shout out to my buddy, DG Productions. One of my favorite slot channels on YouTube. Check them out. Put up your link, buddy. It uh, looks like they're still working on the Aria Marquee over here. Uh, and they're doing construction over here too. Look at this. Looks like everywhere is under construction here on the strip. It's madness, guys. It's madness. Even more madness is I got to carry my mountain bike up the stairs. <laughs> That's even more mad uh, madness right now while holding this camera here. Okay, wish me luck. We're not going in the elevator because I'll probably lose you guys. Okay, carrying the bike with a backpack, with a gimbal, with a camera, wearing a sombrero. Coming through, guys. Thank you. I don't want to drop this bike. It's worth a cool ten dollars. It's cool. Thanks, guys, for waiting. All right. The live stream continues. Down here we have uh, Harmon Avenue. I'll take a second to breathe. Joseph Quattrone is here. Polo Tower is over here. Hilton Grand Vacations Tower. Timeshare. Just connected to the Planet Hollywood. Oh, if you guys didn't know already, Harmon Avenue, this street right here, now has an exit that connects it to the Highway 15. This is very important, guys. See this street right here? This is Harmon and go straight toward the west. And then you can get on uh, Highway 15 now. There's an exit. Uh, you can go, I believe, south. I don't know if you can go north, but I know you can go south for sure because I used it before. That uh, That's supposed to relieve uh, some congestion due to the Tropicana exit being uh, closed so yeah take that if you're uh, trying to get across trying to get across to the west or the east from uh, 15 it's a really good uh, exit right now oh my 
Okay, I gotta walk it here because we're gonna go inside in a second. Hey, Fernando Barreto. Fernando Barreto. Bom dia. Boa tarde. Boa tarde. Como vai? Como vai, baby? Fernando. Scotty C. You gonna need some O2 stations? Yeah, is that right? <laughs> this is uh hi. It's a show off. Hey, J Lo was here. Okay, J Lo was here. Was she here with P Diddy too? <laughs> Up to some shenanigans. This is a uh, this is a sugar factory. Pretty cool spot to come. Better at nighttime though, most definitely. Happy hour. Sugar, azúcar, azúcar. What's up, Lay? Say hello. Got your weed here, roots, roots. Pretty nice storefront. Panda Express here. <coughs> hey, Floyd Quick, what's up? Yeah, we're gonna go for a couple hours here. On the strip. Uh, Walgreens is my worst performing stock in my portfolio. <coughs> Shout out to Walgreens for giving me some paper losses so far. <laughs> no, they, they pay a decent dividend though, so how long, how long that lasts, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, this is uh, Fat Tuesday. Boop, boop. Hey, what's a good drink to get here? Oh, you never had it before. Okay. This is uh, Vegas Inc. Vegas Inc. Pedestrian overpass uh, to Cosmopolitan. Okay, shall we go on this side or this side? What do you guys say? West side or east side? West side or east side? You guys vote. Vote, vote. Should we go on the west side or the east side? AA Photography Film. Happy id. AA Photography Film from Bradford, England. Well, uh, happy id to you. Okay, east side. I see east side. Deluxe. That's the first vote, so we'll go on the east side. This is this side on the right. Oh, sorry. <laughs> we almost had a collision. Oh, there's an elevator. There's a, oh my God, it's old. It's, it's down, huh? Yeah, the same You gotta go go to the Cosmopolitan and go down the elevator in there inside. Yeah, I know. It's uh. It's, uh, it's tough. Yeah, I'm gonna, we, it's hard. Uh, okay. No. Uh, they're trying to figure out how to get down with their scooters.
Gambling shenanigans from New Jersey, okay. Hey, gorgeous day out here, guys, to walk. I'm surprised there's not that many people out here walking, to be honest with you. Uh, I'm not walking myself. <laughs> I'm on a bike. We're trying to cover as much of the strip as we can in like two hours or so. So it's better on a bike. But it's a casual ride. We're in no hurry. We're just chilling today. We're just chilling today. Hopefully we run into some friendly uh, showgirls out here. Hopefully there's friendly showgirls. Kai. Oh, I couldn't read it, guys. I can't go back in the chat. Unless I stop. Top cheese chilling too. That's the laziest drummer I've ever seen right here. Laziest drummer I've ever seen. Oh, they got some uh, fake nut, fake monks, fake monks. Fake monks out here. Careless uh, Islanders, what's up? Careless Islanders, shout out. Boop, boop. Scotty C, I still see you. Floyd Quick, Top Cheese, TNA Adventures, Cal, are bikes permitted on those high flow areas? No. I don't think bikes are permitted on uh, any other sidewalks out here. But we're careful here. We're as careful as can be. And if they tell us to get off, we'll get off. The short shorts are coming out. The summer dresses are coming out. Whoop, whoop. Let's keep going. What a cute little puppy. Cute little puppy. What a cute little puppy. What a cute little puppy. Uh, this, this road, there's traffic coming and you can't block it. We got 250 people in here, right on. 
Thank, thank you, everybody, for coming to the live. What a wonderful surprise. You guys can join us. Let us know where you're watching from. I get a kick out of that. Uh, doing like a roll call and seeing where everybody is uh, watching from. Especially if you're overseas. Especially if you're not in America. We want to hear from you. Vinny P from Toronto, okay. You know I'm going there in about a week and a half. I'll be out there going to Niagara Falls. I'll be in Toronto, staying in Toronto. My first time there, what should I go first? In Toronto, I'll be in uh, Markham. Markham, I think that's north of Toronto. The Markham area. Where should I go, man? Vinny P. Nelson Alston in Baltimore. Whoop, whoop. Steffi P, Massachusetts. Whoop, whoop. Deluxe from England. Our friends across the pond. Anthony Wench from Warrington, UK. All right, Warrington, UK. Got a lot of Brits here. We love our Brit friends. Our number one ally in the world. Ron Peterson. Uh, Scotty C out, out here in Vegas. Local. Just like me. out here people watching on a sunny day looks like we got strong signal Gavin lost from Barbados I don't even know where Barbados is where is that man where's Barbados I hear it's a nice place though Chester UK the cosmos from Lynn Lynn and Dave from Chester United Kingdom whoop whoop got top cheese from planet earth love it same here got uh whew. man my bike my bike is definitely fitting in here <laughs> my bike fits through here uh gavin laws okay barbados in the caribbean I'll be there in May, visiting a few islands, spending some of my money there. <laughs> spending some money there. Uh, Yolanda Lin from Laos, from Laos, all the way to Southeast Asia. Whoop, whoop. Southeast Asia. Here we are in Old Red. I would go to the rooftop, but I have nowhere to put my bike. We went there on the last live stream. We went to the rooftop here at Old Red. Nice view of the strip. Good place to have a, uh, a, a pint. I think the other, it's a chain, right? They have one in Nashville, Tennessee. Nashville, Tennessee. Can't, I can't really stop in anywhere unless I have a place to put my bike.
Just keep moving though. This is a map of uh, the horseshoe and the uh, bazaar shops. Jesus Rodriguez, whoop whoop, is here. Okay, let's go up the escalator. We got more fake nuns over here. What is he doing? I got more uh, fake fake monks. <laughs> fake monks over here. Those guys are scammers, guys. Fake fake monks out here. They do it all over the world. Don't let them put their bracelet on you. Because uh, they'll ask for money or donations or make up some story. They dress up as monks and disgrace the Buddhist culture. Yeah, allegedly. Yeah, I don't know that for sure, but it's it's kind of a known scam around the world, actually. Not not just monks; they dress as uh, different things. Hey guys. Not a ton of people out here on a Wednesday. I've seen it when it was colder and less nice out here, and it was packed. So I, I expected this, expected it to be packed out here. You never know what drives the uh, tourism here. Hello. Jesus Rodriguez, he's out there with a bass, bass, yep, a bass, that's right, bass guitar. Warren's here, welcome Warren, appreciate you dropping by, Warren. Amy S. TNA Adventures are here, Mrs. TNA is here, whoop whoop, I like the hats. Uh, G Gwyn G W Y N, good to see you, G W Y N. Yeah, beautiful blue sky tonight, today.
Margaritaville here. Jimmy Buffett's Margaritaville. Rest in peace, Jimmy, Jimmy Buffett. Uh, they're going to close down this Margaritaville soon. So uh, if you ever get out here and want to see the Vegas location in Margaritaville, you got to get out here before it closes. I don't know the closing date, though. somebody knows a closing day you can put that in the chat for us yeah top cheese you're always out here when it's super hot eh I hear you <laughs> oh yeah yeah see see I see <laughs> I had to, uh, I couldn't put the camera on that girl. She was uh, topless. A sure way to get your live stream shut down. To show topless girls on your live stream. So. Close on Ronnie C. Close on Monday that early. Closing on Monday already, huh? Wow. That's kind of sad. Uh, that Margaritaville has been there for a long time. That Margaritaville. I've been to a lot of the locations around the world. Good place to have a drink and. Uh, the, the food is uh, about average, <laughs> overpriced, but uh, it's a fun time. Sad to see that one uh, close down. You have a lot up in uh, Eugene, Eugene, Oregon. Top cheese, okay. Uh, are they going to close those too? Miller 24912 was in the house. Whoop. Uh, why are they closing? I don't know. Well, you know, Jimmy Buffett passed away a year or two ago. So it probably changed hands. Or they're looking to sell it. Who knows? His heirs, what they're going to do with the, with the properties. He owns a lot of those. He, I think he was a billionaire, right? Jimmy Buffett was a billionaire. This is a uh, pizza cake. Pizza cake right on the strip. Eat, eat and people watch right here. Eat and people watch. Oh, more fake, fake uh, Buddhists. Handing out those bracelets. Asking for donations or whatever. Telling their fake sob stories. And hoping uh, your generosity pays off for them. So far, we've seen three of them. Two fake, two fake monks, and one fake Buddhist lady. We are literally riding this bike and not hitting anything.
Nobody listens to Lucky Ducky. Nobody listens to Lucky Ducky, I tell you that much. He can quack all day and nobody listens to him and nobody gets out of the way. Woo, you are way overdressed for this. Not just kidding. Old music from the 80s. Passing to Venetian on the right. Careless Island it is Yahoo! Yeah, Jesus Roger, she was definitely elegant. One of the many beautiful fountains we have here at the Venetian. I don't see any security guards over here, so let's ride over here. At the Venetian. Looks like a bride. It's gonna ride the gondola. You guys enjoying the little tour daytime tour I usually film at night if you watch my videos 95% of them are at nighttime because I think it's more fun to come out at night it's much more livelier and the lights the neon lights which Vegas is known for shine brightly and beautifully out here So I got cameras, I purchased cameras specifically to do well in nighttime settings. We'll keep moving guys, we'll keep moving go another hour and a half or so hey thank you man thank you I have no right to push you all the way like that I know it thank you the guy got out of the, got out of the way for us we're not even supposed to be on the sidewalk so I'm really grateful if they actually move a move aside like that for us This weekend I will be filming a lot out here because it's warmer. I like the warm weather. I'll be filming at night, probably two videos in the next two weeks. 
of the Las Vegas Strip in 4K. So look out for those. If you haven't already seen my last one, uh, we released that one about five days ago or so. So check that out. Oh, actually, uh, seven days ago. Seven or nine days ago, I don't even know. But uh, take a look at it and get an idea of what those videos look like. I'll be out here filming for three straight days. Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. And I'm gonna edit it since I'm gonna be traveling uh, actually doing NAB, which is National Association of Broadcasters Convention. I'll live stream from there. Hi. Um, NAB is coming up next week. I'll do a live stream from there. National Association of Broadcasters. And then um, I'll post those videos because I'll be traveling, doing a road trip to Toronto, Canada. Hey, Tony Jazz, see you. Tony Jazz, whoop, whoop, welcome. Bike ride, yep, we're on the bike, brother. We are on the bike. Have you done a bike ride lately? I know you uh, did that one out in uh, Venice or a few of those. Have you been on your bike lately? I mean, the weather's probably really nice in Cali. This lady uh, should not be out here. You want to come back over here? Can you get over here? How do I get? Where's the bus stop? Uh, there's one bus stop down that way. Well, I have to go, I have to go north. So how, how yeah, that's north. That way is north. Uh, you got to go up this bridge here. Get over here. Okay. Go around there and then get up to the escalator. Okay. okay. She got stuck out here there's, there somehow. Okay, Jesus Rodriguez, it's uh, 74 degrees in Long Beach. You have a crime, crime wave. What's up with that? Why is the uh, increase in crime? For what? What's up with the crime wave there? Yeah, Tony Jess, she was lost a little bit. She was trying to get to the bus stop. <sighs> Miller 24912, yeah, I try to be a public servant. Yep, I'm an unpaid volunteer public servant from time to time. Oh, we got the view of the sphere right here. Got a view of the sphere and uh, Sands Avenue. Uh, let's take a look. Well, I can get a drink of water here because it is quite warm today. See, so ideal time for an ice cream. To be honest with you. When I'm saving up my appetite, I'm meeting up with the Vegas Best Ideas later at the Durango Casino. And uh, they got hooked up at the Shang Artisan Noodle, so they told me not to eat. So we'll go there. I'm working up my appetite. The Beast from Miami, what's up? 305. I'll be in Miami and uh, I'll be in Miami in uh, May, uh, middle of May, so I plan to make videos out there. Me, I'm me, that's right.
I love it there. Galavantu Slots is here. Whoop, whoop. Spear, spear. We're gonna we'll go down a little bit more and then come back the other way. I parked at the Mandalay Bay, so that's all the way on the other end of this of the strip. Oh man, I couldn't, uh, I was holding my bike so I don't fall down. Couldn't get a video of the showgirls, unfortunately, without my bike rolling down this escalator. Yeah, let's go. We're uh, heading on the north end of the Vegas now, Strip. Testo Media, what's up? RK, Super Film, Danke. You're welcome. Danke, Danke, we well, are welcome. Tony Jazz watching from the International Space Station. All right, wave to us from up there. Give us a wave so we can see you. Tony Jazz from the International Space Station, AISS. He works for NASA, I think. He's a part time uh, whoop whooper for NASA. He takes care of their whoop whoops. We're uh, passing the wind right now. Let's see how far should we go. We're going to turn around sooner or later here. Yeah, you heard that beef before, huh? Is that uh, Dre's beat? Yeah, yeah. Um, I think we're gonna turn here. Take a turn. Take a turn left here. Yeah, we're gonna turn here. Start heading back the other way. Looking beautiful. Looking beautiful. It's a fashion show mall right now we're passing. Yanabat Israel, Shalom, Shalom, Tommy Mendoza, Bienvenidos, compa, que tal? Sleepless in Las Vegas, haha, <laughs> that was ballsy. <laughs> Sleepless in Las Vegas, Ted, welcome, shout out. 
another Vegas YouTuber. He's on IG too. Shout out Sleepless in Las Vegas. What's up, bro? I got to walk with him uh, at the Pizza Expo recently, about a couple weeks ago. <clears throat> Hold up, uh, did Emmett's finally open? They, this, this place was uh, slated to open. I guess it's open now, huh? Uh, I guess they're open now. When did they open? I wish you would come out here. Tell us, tell us a little about Emmett's. Uh, can you come here for a second? Come on. <laughs> I was just, uh, I didn't know you guys opened, so I just wanted to hear what, when you guys opened and all that. Oh, the 26th. Yeah, I was wondering about that. Yeah, so uh, I was doing a live stream and I like to tell my, uh, my audience. I have uh, 2,670 people watching, so yeah, it's a free advertisement. I can't, I have my bike. Yeah, yeah, you guys uh, check out Emmett. Uh, Emmett Smith, of course, the uh, legendary Hall of Fame and Hall of Famer uh, Dallas Cowboy, right? He just opened his uh, restaurant here uh, by himself or with some partners, probably, right? Uh, what kind of food? <laughs> oh, another satisfied customer. Indeed. Foodie lips. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I want to check it out. Okay, thanks. Give us a wave. That's Emmett, 22 Emmett's. <laughs> All right. Rooftop. There's a rooftop too. Social house. Okay, Emmett's Vegas. Dunkin' Donuts is more my speed, though. Dunkin' Donuts is more my speed. No, just kidding. Did I read the number wrong? Miller 24912? What, what's his number? 22, right? I thought it was 22. This is a picture of something right here. Flowers. What's the number? Emmett something. 24912, what is it? Wow, this uh, Verizon, this Verizon uh, network is working well today. Haven't had any problems. That's amazing, huh? Oh, the views watch number. <laughs> you got me. <laughs> Two thousand. Oh, we just lost a couple hundred right there. Two thousand five hundred ninety now. Okay, sleepless in Las Vegas. Ted is heading out, going going to work. Hard working man. Can't be mad at you. Thanks for popping in. Sleepless in Las Vegas. Check him out. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> nice LA hats. Oh, Las Vegas hats. Okay, let's keep moving. Uh, hour. We're an hour and thirty minutes in. We got a. 60% on the battery, so we're good to get all the way back to the Mandalay Bay around that area. Or maybe we stopped at the Shake Shack over there, I don't know. I'm trying to trying to uh, save my appetite for Shang's artisan noodles artisan noodle tonight. At the Durang the new Durango Casino over on the uh, west southwest side of Las Vegas.
Galicia. Martin Taylor's here. Whoop, whoop. Donnie and Marie from Toronto. All right. I'll be there in a week and a half. Toronto, where should I go first? My first time there. I'll be staying up by Markham. Markham, the north area of uh, Toronto, I think. Suburb. Um, thanks for coming, Martin Taylor. Appreciate you. Appreciate you joining as a member also of the Laughing Lion channel. It's only 99 cents, guys. It will help support the live stream. 99 cents a month. Uh, I got a separate Verizon wireless line just for the live streams. So those memberships really help pay for that. We're looking down Spring Mountain here. Spring Mountain Boulevard. Oh, check out the CN Tower, huh? Okay. Is it that spectacular? I know that's a really touristy thing to do, but I guess it's my first time there, right? You got to see the CN Tower. Another escalator. Joe Casey's coming to Vegas. October, that's a good month, if you can, if you can make it. This is, uh, people that actually sleep over here, as you can see. That's probably urine right there. Homeless people, like, sleep over here. I have to clean up over here because they urinate over here, right? So. <laughs> serious? Why so serious? It's casual. Jason Wilhelm, Wilhelm, Wilhelm. Yep, yep. Jesus Rodriguez, the Joker. <laughs> uh, fake pirate trip. Oop, it's getting wet, it's weather wet over here. Gotta back up. Senior frogs. Senior frogs. Fake pirate ships. Gillies. This is a fun spot, though. Gillies is a fun spot. They got a bull. They got a bull in here you can ride.
you guys are enjoying the live stream, hit the like button for us. Thank you so much for coming. We're having fun out here. At least I'm having fun. You guys enjoying it? Top cheese, they should comp you a drink with that sombrero. I agree. Oh yeah, booze at Senor Frogs. I think it's actually closed. Senor Frogs is closed right now. I think it opens at night. I went to a drag show there. <laughs> It was like a, it was a fun drag show with Rick's Vegas. You know those, uh, those drag shows are crazy, man. You end up, we got comped to go in and all free food and everything, but you end up spending all this money on tips. Those drag, you know those drag shows, where they're, uh, the guys dress as women and then they sing and dance and everything. And then they beg for beg for uh, tips. We end up spending like a hundred dollars on tips. Isn't that crazy? All the food and drinks were a comp, bro. But uh, it was a good show. Forgot what the show was called. Joe Casey, thank you, number one Vegas channel. <laughs> I like to be known as at least in the top one thousand Vegas channels. But number one, whoop whoop. We'll take that. Thank you, Joe Casey, for your kind words. There's a convention going on here, too. Over at the Mirage. Or the Venetian. Twenty-four nine twelve. yeah. It was kind of a drag. That drag show, I have to say. Thanks for reminding me to say that. I like the sound of uh, these little waterfalls, these cascades, cascading waterfalls here. How about the sound of those cascading waterfalls? <laughs> it's a quiet oasis over here on the strip. I'm not sure how long this volcano is going to be here. It seems like it seems to uh, stick around for a long time here. They keep saying they're going to close it, but it's still open. And I believe the volcano, sh volcano shows are still going because I saw it last week. Does anybody know when they're going to close this volcano? Close it down? Anybody know in the chat? Let us know. They're supposed to put a hard rock guitar shaped hotel right here right in place of this volcano and water feature. Top cheese, uh, does Wayne Newton still perform? Yes, I believe he does. He does like an intimate show for like uh, 50 to 100 people. Um, and he tells his stories of his old days in Vegas and all the celebrities he knows. It's an interesting show. I forgot where it's at. I think it's at the Harrah's or I think at the Harrah's. I could be wrong though.
Hey, VW Vloggers with Attitude. Whoop, whoop. Good to see you. <laughs> uh, happy 420, which is coming up soon. VW, VWA Vloggers with Attitude, shout out. It's been a minute. One of the funniest guys on YouTube I know. I'm, I'm hands down, no lie. Vloggers with attitudes. Vloggers with attitudes, VWA. One of the funniest dudes I know on YouTube. Yeah, top, top cheese, yep, classic Vegas stuff. That's right. Yeah, happy early 420. Whoop whoop. I'll be in Canada, man. I'll be in uh, I'll be in Ni Niagara Falls and uh, Toronto. I heard they probably had some good weed there. I think uh, I think uh, whoops. I think uh, Canada has a lot more strict strict rules about their marijuana, right? <laughs> than America. So who knows how that is. We got the fake Fontana di Trevi. La Fontana di Trevi. Fontana di Trevi. I've been to the one in Rome, pretty cool. It was way too busy at the time, man. Like, there was like 200 people, two to 300 people right at that fountain. It was uh, nuts. I guess the best time to go is like 3 a.m. in the morning when nobody's there. The one in Rome. Roma. Bonjour. Miller 24.9 tell, have I traveled to Russia? Privet, Privet. I know that's how you say it. That's how you greet people in Russia, right? Privet. No, I have not been to Russia yet. And I'm probably not gonna go this summer either. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'd like to visit Moscow someday. Moscow. But uh, as you know, there's lots of uh, world conflicts going on there at this moment. So, have you ever visited there before? 20, Miller 24912? Looks like something is going on in this. Uh, this uh, parking lot it's probably part of the uh, part of a convention or something maybe we're trying to crash this party over here Maybe we'll try to crash his party. It's at the Caesar's Palace. Whoops, mist. Water mist over here. I don't want to get the lens wet. There's a big water mist over here. Aha. Uh -huh. Looks like it's uh looks like it's over. Looks like the party is over here. So, uh, let's just cut through. Let's cut through.
some kind of a convention or event was happening there. This is the back of the fountains, the one that evil can evil once once scaled over this back in the what 1960s or 70s or something. Evil can evil jumped over these fountains. Woo! 50 or 60 years ago or something. Anybody know? I gotta go back around, guys. There's no exit here. We got trapped. Yeah, we got trapped. We gotta go back around. Okay, here we go. We'll go through here. We'll go through here. This is where we came in. Robbie Knievel did too, Jesus Rodriguez. Was that his son or something? Or his twin, twin brother, Robbie Knievel? Grandson? I don't know, let us know. This is a good photo spot right here. Thank you so much. I love this. Oh, another uh, fake Buddhist. Yeah, guys, if you see those guys giving out bracelets, you don't want to take it unless you feel like donating to a scammer. Oh, there's another one. They got bracelets, and they're looking for tourists to place their bracelets on their wrists, and then they'll ask for donations. Just be wary of that stuff. It's just like any tourist town in the world. Oh, go ahead, guys. Yeah. Good. <laughs> okay. I saw you earlier, DG Production. I saw you earlier. Yeah, traffic here, traffic, traffic. Don't take those bracelets. Don't take those bracelets. You know about that, right? Yeah. Oh, another fake monk over here. See, he asked for donations there. For whatever his cause is. Inside the Bellagio, just cutting through here. We're not gonna spend any time here.
because we have a bike. <laughs> Can't bring my bike through the casino floor. Actually, the last time I live streamed at the Bellagio, uh, a word of warning inside the inside the what do you call it? This botanical gardens. One of the songs inside the botanical gardens is copyrighted. Actually, all of the songs are copyrighted, but there's one song that's copyrighted, and the the guy will strike your channel immediately. You'll get a strike on your channel. <laughs> and that's what happened to me. I live streamed for like 30 minutes inside the botanical gardens and there was a the person that owned the copyrighted song strikes everybody's channel automatically. And you only get three strikes on your channel before you get terminated. So you gotta watch out if you're ever gonna do a recording. During the springtime, during the springtime here in uh, springtime here in the botanical gardens. Let's see. I think the the water show is going to be happening fairly soon here. So let's check the time. What time is it, guys? What time is it? Do a time check here. Latin, Latin cube cup essay. What is a copywriter? It's an owner of music, copyright, or owner of any uh, licensed work. It could be writing, it could be. Uh, could be a photo, could be a video, could be a song. That's what a copyright is. Somebody owns it. Uh, in this case, in YouTube, uh, a lot of this music is copyrighted. That you'll hear in the background and you gotta be careful what music is playing in the background in case uh, some copyright owners don't allow music to be played on your video. So you gotta watch out for that. Jesus Rodriguez, DG Production, thank you, 4.20 p.m. Okay, we're not going to wait around here for any uh, water shows. Just taking a casual ride. We'll go another, I don't know, we'll see, half hour or so. Gorgeous day, guys. Get out here to Vegas if you can. I mean, the weather can't be any better. I think it's like 78 degrees Fahrenheit, 26 degrees Celsius. People doing photo shoots out here. Families out here, bring her the kids. Selfie whores over here, selfie whores. Speaking of selfie whores, I think I need to do a selfie myself. Selfie myself. Thanks everybody for watching and coming to the live stream. We're in hour number two already. We're two hours. Bienvenidos a Las Vegas. Muchos gringos aquí. Muchos gringos.
Cult of the Donuts is here, straight out of the DNN Donut News Network. What is happening? What's the latest news on the DNN, my friend? Hey, Jesus Rodriguez, I see you. Joe Casey is right here, styling and profiling. Yeah, that's what we do. That's what we do. If you guys just got here, you guys are two hours late. We started two hours ago. You guys can scrub back, watch the replay if you like. It was a fun little ride so far. You guys make it more fun. You guys come in in the chat on the live. You guys make it a lot more fun. All 2,350 of you guys. All 2,350 of you guys. <laughs> Last I looked, it was uh, 23,500. Last time I looked, we're down to 2,350. I'm going to be filming out here, making some videos in 4K this weekend. Thursday, Friday, Saturday. be spending many hours out here filming, people watching. So I'll post those videos in a week or two. They're going to be highly edited. Showing the best of the best and people watching out here in Vegas. So look for those. The weather is going to be warm. So... It will be fun, 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 fun out here. The beautiful Cosmo Resort, Cosmopolitan of Las Vegas. Taking a casual ride. Viva Las Vegas. You like the Fremont lives? Joe Casey? Cool. We'll probably do one too this weekend. We'll probably do a live this weekend. We'll see. Big time, Kako, rocking the sombrero. That's right. That's how we do it. Oh. All right. Uh, looks like I gotta carry my bike up these stairs. No, hay problema. No, hay problema. Lucky Ducky says. Lucky Ducky says, no, hay problema. Okay. Uh. Uh. All right. Mission accomplished. Mission accomplished. Oh yeah, guys, something new happened here. See this street right here, this Harmon Avenue? They opened a freeway e exit on Harmon Avenue recently, like three to six months ago, three months ago. So if you need to get on Highway 15, take Harmon, take Harmon right here. Go down this way up a little bit, about a quarter mile. You can exit to 50, Highway 15, it's a very convenient little uh, freeway entrance it's a new one i think it's there temper uh it's there permanently because of the the construction being done on the tropicana avenue 
um, flyover they call it, overpass. I, t I took that way and uh, I was right on the freeway, no, no traffic or nothing. It's awesome. Instead of going on Flamingo or uh, what's the other one, Russell Road, Spring Mountain, those are other ways to get on Highway 15. But I recommend taking that uh, Harmon if you're right here on the heart of the strip. Uh, Miller 24912, have I made a video, had a chance to make a video at Old Red? Yeah, actually the last live stream we were at, we were at the rooftop of Old Red. We were at the rooftop. Yes indeed, I was able to make a video. Let's see. How am I going to get across? There's construction here. Now there's an elevator over there. Or I can take, I can carry my bike down these stairs. Sheesh. The options are not that good because the elevator I might lose the signal. Okay, let's, uh, let's gamble a little bit. We'll go into the elevator. This is a very short elevator ride. I mean, very, very short. Uh, you know, let's cut through the... Well, the Crystal Malls is not very good either for signal. Yeah, we're already uh, buffering already, right? I know we're buffering. Hold on, guys. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> we're already buffering, see? Okay, let's go. There's not very many options here except taking this elevator or carrying down that staircase again. So hang in there if it's buffering. This is street level right here. Yeah, oh, okay, DG Production, thank you. Still clear? I think we're good then. We are good. All good in the neighborhood, guys. Are you streaming? Yeah! Are you guys too? I'm on kick. Kick. kick awesome. I don't have kick, but I'm on YouTube. You're on YouTube? Hey, Hi, guys. YouTube. What's, up, man? What's your channel called? DTAM MB. DTAM MB. DTAM MB. B. All right, you heard it here. Shout out. I'm Kick. You, man. Yes, hey, I like your cup. Thank you, bro. Also, what, what are you drinking? What's your channel? Uh, the Laughing Lion on YouTube. Laughing the Laughing Lion, Lion on YouTube. You don't get that. Hey. I like the bike and the hat, man. Yeah, I like Grab the shirt. Going, the beautiful lady here. Thank you, guys. <laughs> They're on Kick. Anybody else on Kick? Live streaming on kick. I don't have kick. Okay, it looks like we're buffering still. We're buffering a little bit. Let's get out of this area really fast. Wow. We're gonna go around here through Aria because I don't want to carry this bike up again or take an elevator because we're gonna lose the signal. So let's go around here, pretty nice and scenic over here too. Aria, Vidara, the crystal shops over here. Look at that. 
Look at that, uh, look at that artwork. It's a little uh, lollipop there. Yeah, beautiful Aria Resort here, man. You guys have a chance to stay here. It's beautiful. Four stars, five stars, I don't know. Take a look. Very modern architecture here. DG Production, did you, have you guys stayed here before? This is the front lobby registration right there. You guys love the Aria? Have you guys stayed here before? DG Production? Sometimes they have water flowing down these walls right here. They have water flowing down these walls. They turn them off for now. It'd be nice if they were turned on. You got pigeon chairs here. They got these pigeon chairs. Or doves. Dove birds. Pigeons, dubs, I don't know. One of the two. Oh, they got that uh, Aria Express tram. Uh, I gotta adjust the hat there. Proper Eats Food Hall, this uh... uh One of the eateries there, Shalom, Shalom Y'all. <laughs> Interesting name. Egghead, Easy Donuts, Speak Easy Donuts. Anybody eat at the Proper Eats? The Laughing Buddha, Ramen. Lola's Burgers. Soul Bird Tamaka Bar and the Poker Go Studio whoop, whoop, is right here. They have a high stakes poker, high stakes poker streams and videos you can watch on YouTube. High stakes poker, Waldo Astoria is down this way. This is one of the tallest buildings here in Vegas. Anybody get a chance to stay here? P. Martinez, Egghead is delicious. Jim B, whoop whoop. You like MGM properties for the varieties of restaurants, DG Production says. Big Time Kako is still here. Cult of Donuts is still here. Bram de Bach stayed in Aria for two weeks last summer. Great hotel from Belgium. All the way from Belgium. Thanks. Thanks for coming, man. I don't know anybody from Belgium. 
Very cool that you joined us here. Two hours and 12 minutes in. Battery's still good, 39%. But we're not gonna go much longer, guys. Uh. We're passing uh, Whataburger and Perry's Pizzeria. P Perry's Pizzeria and Tap House. <laughs> um, I tried Whataburger here. I tried Whataburger and I uh, was not impressed. I haven't tried the pizza here though yet. Uh, looks like you can. They opened up the glass doors here. They opened up the glass doors. So what a burgers here. I came here like uh, a few days after they opened. Open 24/7. So if you're hungry late night, drunk and high, you might want to try it out. They got uh, TV screens in there so you can watch sports. And a pizza parlor upstairs with a nice little view of the strip, a balcony view. Not a bad spot. I gotta try the pizza though. Buenas, buenas. Uh, gracias, gracias. It's pretty tranquilo out here, man. Tranquilo. What's up, Flair? What's up? Oh, they close this down? Oh. Oh. Crack Shack, see? Crack Shack is still open. Hey, there we go. The chicken is wearing the Golden Knights jersey. Vegas Golden Knights jersey here. Shout out to Las Vegas Golden Knights. We're heading to the playoffs, hopefully. We got a rough year of in injuries again. Rough year of injury. Uh, our captain, Mark Stone's out. Alex Petrangelo. Uh, William Carrier. Man, we got a lot of key players out. But we're still hanging in there trying to make the playoffs. We're in a decent position to do that. Hopefully we can repeat as NHL... Stanley Cup Finals champions. We're looking to repeat this year. It's gonna be tough. It's always tough, right? <laughs> but uh, good luck to the Vegas Golden Knights. I'll be here. Um, I probably won't watch any games at the T-Mobile Arena, which is right here around the corner, which is their home. We'll go down here to the T-Mobile Arena area. 
Is there a game tonight? Actually, there is a game tonight. I think they're playing somebody really good. I forgot who they play. They play, uh, who are they playing? Not, they just played Vancouver. They lost to Canucks. I think they're playing uh, Edmonton, right? Are they playing the Oilers tonight? I gotta get across here. Who are the Golden Knights playing tonight, guys? The Oilers look really good this year. They always look every. They always look good every year, don't they? They gotta. They gotta. Uh, they gotta perform in the playoffs. Lucky Legion slots. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> you gonna be here? Where are you? Are you here in Vegas? Eek, not in Vegas. E E K. Oh, they got the uh, Hello Kitty Cafe. You gotta check this place out. You got Playoff Perry this year, yep. Nice addition. <laughs> He's working on the Jenga. The giant Jenga. As you can see, this is VGK line, Vegas Golden Knights land. Hockey puck right here, if you didn't know what that is. It's a hockey puck. Hello. I'm surprised they're letting me ride my bike over here. I've been stopped many times riding my BC here. Me BC around this place. It's a T-Mobile Arena, the home of the Vegas Golden Knights here. They also call it Toshiba Plaza. <laughs> Setting something up over here. Back up. Good, good. Almost got hit. Almost got ran over by a. Uh, almost got ran over by uh, what do you call those forklifts? Should have used my horn. Jim B. Crotch shot. Miller twenty four nine twelve. I've heard the artist who created Hello Kitty said. The Hello Kitty is not a cat. Yeah, I'm not sure what it is. You're, it's true. I don't think it started out as uh, being a cat. It's not supposed to be a cat. It's supposed to be a little, like a, a student. Like a grade school student, I believe. I know, uh, we'll head over to the Tropicana and end it there. We're going to end the live stream at the Tropicana.
have a moment of silence. I want to have you guys join me in a moment of silence for the Tropicana before it gets demolished into rubble and dirt to make way for a Oakland A's baseball stadium and entertainment complex. Um, the Tropicana is across the street. Cat a corner to this property over here in New York, New York. A lot of good eateries here. Shake Shack, of course, out of New York City, New York. Tamar Briley. What's up? Good to see you, bud. You're a little bit late. <laughs> We're two hours and 30 minutes in and about to wrap it up pretty soon here. We rode all the way from the welcome sign, the famous welcome sign on the south end of the strip, all the way up to Fashion Show Mall and the Encore. This place is, uh, gets really busy during events at the T-Mobile Arena. This right here is a fake Brooklyn Bridge. <laughs> the fake Brooklyn Bridge. On the left. They actually have a band set up, live, live music over here, often. There's a stage right here, see? On the Brooklyn Bridge, right here on the Brooklyn Bridge, there's a stage where they play, uh, they have live bands, usually on the weekends. There's a creepy hand over here. A creepy hand for no reason. <laughs> Joe Casey says was a grand back in 1995, okay. Miller Turton, 24 9 12. I've heard Major League Baseball doesn't have a stadium deal with Vegas yet, so I don't see why you were, they were such a hurry to shut down operations in Tropicana, yep. Yeah, they don't have a solid deal yet, but they're planning for the future. Probably had uh, backup plans. And they're sure ones are going to operate the Tropicana anymore. Oh my God, that looks so good. That looks so good right here. The shake, Woo. chocolate Sunday at the Hershey's. I'm saving my appetite because I'm heading over to the Durango Casino to meet up with Vegas Best Ideas. <laughs> oh, the Oilers. Look at you, Oiler girls. <laughs> there you go. You got some Oiler girls here. <sighs> Wait, I thought the game was in Edmonton. Is the game here in Vegas? Okay, let's uh, let's get across the street to the Tropicana, which is over there, that white building over there. We'll do a candle visual. No, not really a candle visual, but we'll do a moment of silence 
for the Tropicana. Wow, looking like some traffic over here. Let's get up this stairs. Okay. Okay. Heading across the street. Oh, they got another fake monk over here. Another fake monk. Someone's giving her a cash app or something. Look at that. Fake monks. We saw a lot of fake monks out here, man. Today. I guess they come out at night. A uh, daytime, I mean. Yeah, you see those monks out here. You might want to think twice before having them approach you and you give you letting them put a bracelet on your wrist cuz they're known to be scammers boop, boop. What is this, like the 20th stair uh, escalator we've been up today? Lucky Legion slots, that's right. It's probably most likely not a monk. They have that scam around the world where they have these bracelets, cheap bracelets. They uh, approach tourists and put them on people's wrists and then they ask for donations for whatever cause or whatever scam they're pulling at the time. Looking down Las Vegas Boulevard, AKA the Strip and Tropicana over here. We'll go in front of the Tropicana and end the live stream there. After we have a moment of silence for the Tropicana legendary property. Sound like Jack Johnson. Jack Johnson. Is that Jack Johnson? Jack. Jack. Forget his name. Guy from Hawaii. 
Jack something. I saw I actually saw him in concert a while back. Forgot his name though. Alright, we're at the we're at the Tropicana guys. Putting the hat down. Packable right there, that's packables. Uh, Vegas best ideas. Michelle Moroy. Straight out of Vegas, Joe. Some of the VCC members. All right, hey. Where are, you, where are you from? Monterrey. Uh, Monterrey, yeah. yeah. Un gran ciudad. Muy bonito. No conozco, pero. Mexico? Hay un YouTuber de este uh, Monterrey. Y yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo vi, vi su canal siempre uh, caminando por uh, ah, sí. las calles de uh, Monterrey. Monterrey. Es uh, muy bonito. ¿Tú yeah. también, YouTuber? Uh, yo soy de aquí, ah, Las Vegas, yeah. San Jose, California. So, sí. Estoy en vivo. Ah, Estamos bien. en vivo. Ah, okay. <laughs> Dile uh, hola. Hola, hola. Hola de Monterrey, México. Saludos, wow. Saludos Monterrey, de Monterrey. México. Hi, Nancy. <laughs> Nancy. Yeah. Se llama? Hi, Nancy. Nancy. Hi, Nancy. Oh, estás uh, vlogger, too, también? Yeah, yeah. Oh, tienes canal de YouTube, or? Sí, I Instagram o no sé. Sí, ¿Cuál? Este... ¿Cuál es? Déjate ¿Cómo se llama? Se llama... Nancy. I, I Nancy. I Nancy. A -H Nancy. A -H Nancy. E Nancy. E Nancy. 777. 777. Ok, aquí. So, uh, um, here. Tengo tarjeta para, para que recordar, recordarme. Okay. Ciao. Okay. Ciao. Buen dia. Okay, guys. A moment of silencio. Un momento de silencio. A moment of silence for the Tropicana, guys. Join me. Join me for a moment of silence. Okay, guys. Thank you for uh, thank you for joining us on the live stream. This was a moment of silence for the Tropicana, a legendary property here on the Strip. Um, it's been here for 67 years. I'm sure a lot of you guys had a lot of memories here, great memories. Um, it's time to look forward to the future, and they will be demolishing this property probably a little after the summer or in the fall. I'm not sure. And um, yeah, say goodbye to the Tropicana Las Vegas. Thank you all for joining us on the live stream. We'll see you on the next one, guys. We'll probably be on Fremont Street this weekend. Thank you, each and every one of you guys, for coming, especially the moderators and the channel members. And if you're watching on a replay, thank you for uh, coming to the live stream, guys. Thanks. Have a good one. Peace from Las Vegas.